I've been avoiding this video like the plague, but here we are. We're gonna review the Kendall and Kylie face palette, actually blush and highlighter cheek quad. So if you guys want to know my thoughts and opinions, just keep on watching. But before you swipe me away or click me on this video, please like, comment, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Thank you. Okay, the reason why I have been avoiding this video is because I don't typically wear face makeup. Um, I usually just do my makeup when I go to work, so three days a week. But I don't wear anything on my face, such as foundation, concealer, or anything like that when I go to work because I have to wear a mask all day. And I just find it kind of stupid. Like I really, I literally just started wearing lipstick again underneath my mask. And the only reason why is because I have so many, if you see, and I feel like they're just going to waste. Like I have to throw half of my Kylie ones out because of the fact that they're so old and I haven't been wearing them. So that is why I started wearing them under my mask. But I just feel like if I were to wear foundation and all that under my mask i just feel like it would be festering pimple city and i'm very big on skincare so that is not something that i want to do i'm going to go ahead and go in with um first of all i use this uh becca primer and this is the jaclyn um cosmetics blur tinted uh moisture or is it just a blur tint? I don't know. Mine's in fair. Right now, I'm a little bit darker um, than my norm because I've been hiking a lot. Let me go ahead and finish blending this in and then we will come back and try out the palette. Okay, so since this is a face video, I'm just... Whoa, that is too yellow. That is crazy, hold on. I grabbed the wrong one. We'll blend that in there. So I accidentally grabbed yellow by Jeffree Star Cosmetics instead of the pale yellow. Also, we will contour and highlight with this. this laugh at that. I know I have a little itty bitty forehead. So, I feel like an Aztec warrior every time we do this. I have such a small forehead, like I don't even see the point in contouring up here because of the fact that it's just hilarious. My cats are about to start fighting. Anyway, I'm gonna finish blending this out. Then we can move on. All right. <laughs> that yellow was a little, little too yellow. We will set our face now. Oh my God. I don't know about you, but I feel like this is a looking a little crazy. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of like it. Um, I'm just setting my face with uh, the Jeffree Star powder and natural. Blend this out because that is super yellow. Uh, Kabuki decided to join us. I decided to put on some uh, eyebrows and lipstick real quick because I feel like I look crazy. Okay, I put Kylie on by Kylie. And I just did my eyebrows just because I felt like I look crazy with just this foundation and concealer. You guys, this is looking good in this video. It ain't even about this stuff. <laughs> um, yeah, that yellow looked a little crazy, but I kind of like it now. Anyway, we're going to dive into this finally. And there is a cream blush. 
a powdered blush, a little cream bronzer, and a highlight. Okay, when I first got it, I was super excited. To be honest, nothing called my attention. Oh, there is a mirror in here, by the way. It's just covered. Nothing from the Kendall and Kylie collection really called my name. The palette was pretty, but I feel like I have all those colors already. I also felt like the the lip crayons, as much as I love lipstick, it just, the colors I liked, but I don't know about lip crayons. The reason why I love Kylie's liquid lips is because I could kiss my husband and they don't come off and they last for hours. And that is what I really love about her liquid lipsticks. They are my favorite ones out there. So when it came to this, this was the only thing that I was really intrigued by, but the pan sizes are so small, I think, for the $40 that you pay. Um, my dogs are breaking. Colors are 818 Please, She Does It All, Love You Sister, and Don't Be Dramatic. So I'm going to go in. I don't like, I was just about to say, I don't really use cream bronzer, but I mean... I didn't really use cream, um, what's it called? Concealer and like contouring before I started using KKW. So I guess we'll do the same. So I'm dabbing, dabbing, dabbing. But I'm just not seeing it. <laughs> this is just, doesn't seem to be working for me. I'm gonna go ahead in with my finger. Mm. Is this a highlight more than it's a, like a bronzer? Am I tripping right now? Okay, I can tell you As of right now, unfortunately, my f camera doesn't film in HD. Um, I don't like it because I feel like once I put it on, that it just kind of added texture to my skin that I didn't have, if that makes sense. I don't know, I feel like it's highlighting and making my pores look a little bigger than what they were. <laughs> well, I guess it's a highlighter and technically not um, a bronzer. I'm gonna quickly go in with the Skinny Dip duo then because that is the bronzer that I love from her brand oh my god I don't know why my cat and my dogs are like all up in my business for one kabuki mommy's filming cares okay i don't know definitely don't really care for that okay so let's try the blush okay it's definitely picking up I feel like that's a pretty color, but I'm not really good with cream products. So I feel like I don't know exactly how much to use, but I do feel like that's a really pretty color. I usually just smile and kind of go in this area on my cheek. 
But I'm gonna drag it out and go on this side and do the same. I think I put way too much on this side and then this side. I'm not a blush person, to be honest, but I like this. It's really pretty, but I don't feel like it's even. And that is my skill set. I'm just not used to cream blush, but I do like how pretty it is. So I'm gonna go ahead and we'll just go over with it because I'm hoping that this pink will soften up a bit. Um, so this is usually what I would do. I'd grab some, do that, and then kind of just do this. Oh my God, now my dogs are staring at me through my window here. I feel like in person it looks like a lot, but I feel like on camera it looks nice. So I don't know what to think. Okay, last but not least, is this my highlighter brush? Yes, it is. So I'm going to go in with the bottom one. This I didn't care for at all. Like I did not care for that whatsoever. All right, let's see, let's see. I think this is Don't Be Dramatic. I don't know. I honestly hate when they put the names on the back. I hate this shit. I don't know what this correlates to. Like that is not my favorite. That's a pretty color. That is really pretty. I feel like I also just put a shit ton of product on. Okay, I don't know if this is going to make sense to you, but it makes a little bit of sense to me. I feel like the palette is pretty like a natural neutral looking face palette. And I feel like that's really Kendall because I don't feel like Kendall kind of wears a lot of stuff on her face. She's not like a huge, I think, makeup person in general. Um, so I feel like this makeup palette is true to who she is. I do think that now it looks really pretty. $40 though, I don't know. Like, I don't feel like you get a lot for that price, but I don't know, you're paying for the name. But overall, I feel like it looks gorgeous. Like everything just looks really pretty together. What do you think? I'm gonna laugh if I finally upload this and you can just see splotches of freaking yellow concealer and like pink and just bronze like mixture. Um, but anyway, you guys let me know down below. Overall, I do like it a lot. Um, don't really care for that color, which I think is she does it all. Cream blush, I normally wouldn't gravitate to. I'm not a blush person, but it is really pretty. Um, I feel like if you put this over, it kind of tones it down and the highlight is gorgeous. I think overall it looks really, really pretty. Um, so yeah, I should have tried this without any makeup and like face makeup to see like no foundation, no concealer, no um, contouring to see what it looks like but anyway thank you guys so much for watching and joining me on this video comment down below share subscribe see you on the next one bye